Hey, did you see this new study? Sunlight-powered, multicolor, and uniform luminescence and material engineer- Huh? Right. Scientists made glow-in-the-dark plants. Oh. But they don't glow too bright. Uh. But you can repeat the charging and glowing process over and over. Oh. But they only glow for about an hour or so. Uh. The first glowing plant was actually made back in 1986. Huh. By combining genes from a firefly with a tobacco plant. What? <laughs> yeah, every so often, genetics is just kind of like that. In fact, last year, a firefly petunia was on sale to the public. So this isn't actually that new. Huh. But this is the first time scientists have done this with multiple colors. Ooh. But this time, rather than genetically modifying the plants, they injected various colorful glowing particles that the plant takes in. Ow. Oh. But that means this process could be used on a wide variety of plants without having to do all the work of genetic modification. Oh. But they're still a ways away from any kind of practical use. Ah. Uh. But it's still progress, and it's still neat. Well, uh, well, uh, uh. Nuance? Yep, you can find the original paper and our full breakdown on our website.